Hello ladies and gentlemen, uh, my name is Hayden, see, and in this video I am going to take apart the original Xbox console. Well, I've, I've, I've already done a video of this console, but it's a bit, it's the um, crap one. Plus in the other one, I'll show you how to um, take it apart and um, I'll show you when I take the hard drive out and took that bit off. Then I take the disk drive off, took that apart. Well, in that video, the um, the audio was a fast, was a bit, was a bit, was ahead of the um, the audio was ahead of the picture. So yeah, that one's a bit crap. But but in this video, this is a new video, but it's a diff. It's also different because today I've actually got it plugged in at the beginning of this video. Which you can see, and there's already a game in there. And also, in today's video, I'm going to take the top off, take the hard drive out. We're going to do that hard drive bit again. All right? Take, we take the case, bit, the whole thing out, and then take it out of its case. We're going to do that again, but we're not going to take the hard, we're not going to take the disk drive apart today. Instead, we are going to see if we can take get the. See if we can clean the fan. So, <clears throat> so see if we can do that. So we'll get cracking. So we'll get cracked. We'll get started right away. Okay, the tool so you're gonna need is is you're gonna need a one a T20 one T20 T10 and a T15 and a T15 those are the three tools you need but I've actually got the whole collection if you can see here I've got all of them I've got the I've got all um I've got a T I've got all the T T6 T7 T8 T9 T10 T15 T20 and T25 I've got all of them so that's the whole collection just one um frame whatever you want to call it so yeah that's what I got so we'll get started so well, right first thing you need to do is you need to turn the console off right you need to plug it that's what you need to do then when you've done that to flip it over Then you need to flip it over. Just bear with me for a second. Now well, you need to get your T20 because to hook the because screws that hold the top on is a uh, a size 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 20 T20 screws. So so get stuck. We'll do that in a sec. It's easy to do it with the other hand. Everything. Yeah, let's put that. Okay, right. Let's get the screw out. Hopefully, this new this. This new, this new video, this new video. So hopefully, the audio doesn't go. It's not a way ahead of the picture. So hopes, hopefully, it won't be like that. Right, we need to. Uh, right. What I'm doing at the moment is to get all the screws out, so bear with me. It's that one. Turn it around.
done. Right now, what to do is flip it back over. Sorry about all that noise, that's all. Oops, the wrong way. It's all that noise outside. It's just kids making fucking noises. It sort of ruins it. Right, there we go. We've got the top, got the uh, top part off. Now, this is what it looks like inside, obviously. Just what it looks like inside. I just say that anyway. See, that's what it looks like. So, what we're going to do, like in the last video, what i done is I took... Before I took this bit out, I took that screw out there. So what we need to do first, we need to take this whole outer casing bit off that the hard drive sits in. And after that, we're going to take this bit off. So, you need to get your T10, because we need to um, unscrew that screw there. But first, before we do that, we need to take these plugs out. So, this one should be a bit easier. This big one here. There we go. This comes out easy. Well, that one's... This white one looks like it's moved a bit. That shouldn't be a too much problem. Right now, this is where you get your T10, so just bear with me a second again. Come on, where are we at? There we go, got it. Let's check. Yep, right screw. Got the right one. Let's get the T10 screw out. Right, now, what to do is take the screw out. Done. Right now, let's just take this out. Right, that's done. Right, put that aside for a sec. do that a bit later so I'll just put that on there set if it gets over there. Right in first before I take before we take the hard drive off that plus that bit off first we're gonna take move remove the dash drive so get your T ten again same on the other side two screws that hold this dish drive down it's just only it's only for the front that the screws that hold the, the screws that hold the top on secures the um dish drive at the back will secure the screw at the back secure the dish drive at the back of it so I can do it with one hand because of the last time I had to do it with two hands. There we go. Got it. Right. So let's see if we can get this plug out. There we go. That was quite easy actually. Yeah, it's quite a bit of dinner. It's a bit dusty. Look at that. Anyway, right now what we need to do is we need to get that little plug out here.
get con concentrate a bit. It's quite hard. There we go. Let's come out. Okay. Okay. Now, now what we can do is you now all that dust. Yeah. See, that's quite a lot of dust. But we're not going to do that at the moment. First, we're going to take. We are going to come back to that. First, we are going to check if we just if there's any dust in it. I just like to make sure, because you never know, dust might, you never know how quick dust gets on stuff. Right, this is where you get your T15 out. T15, where is it? Where is T15? Here we go, found it. Fifteen. Now, what we need to do is take the screws out. Tell you what, let's take the screws out. screws to go oh moving <laughs> there we go got it the last screw. Right now we can get the hard drive out. There we go. That's the hard drive. Like that. Right now what we're gonna do we are going to right what we're gonna do see that's what it looks like here. That's what the hard drive looks like. That's there that's the chip there. It's quite heavy, and that's what it looks like. It's pretty cool, isn't it? <clears throat> Where well, does it has? It does say like, like it says like it's manufacturer. Uh, it's got bits of information. It's got quite a lot barcodes on it. It's got a lot of information on it. It's got a lot of information on it. 